Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Rogue Tech Cold Forged. So between episodes, I had a quick look at uh, our situation here. It looks like we've only got one more mission we can do on this planet, I think, without facing the clans. And we know how bad that can turn out. So we're going to pull off that last mission here. Now I sold a couple of things in the meantime, just so we have enough to make our financial report. So we can just leave the system after we finish up this mission. Um, so we're going to jump right into that mission now, and that is another Trap Sprung mission. Let's hoping that we let's hope that we have better um, um, results than the last time. The mechs that we were up against were really lousy, so let's hope for a better result. And we're gonna go full out here, full salvage, drop our main lance back in, um, and let's deploy and get this done. All right. Well, it's the same map as last time. Yeah, except it's night time. So let's move up the hill. Holding. Find out what we're up against. Kill it and go home. Really hoping that uh, it's actually a heavy mech this time. Because that javelin, I don't consider it to be a heavy mech. Yeah. Double time. Let's go. So I had a look at some of the stuff we got in storage. Yeah. We've got lots of stuff to... Um, rebuild our mechs with, which is good. Got it. No shooting, just running. I think I will put that uh, Ultra AC, the Clan Ultra AC-20 on our uh, Wolverine once we get that up and running. We were able to repair a little bit last episode. Um, we had a bonus to our um, our mech bay of plus three, so I decided to spend a little bit of cash and get the Wolverine a little bit fixed. Okay, nice. Someone's moving on two. Maybe more than one. It's this guy. Yeah. I don't... Oh, that's a medium. Ah! Let's reserve. See what he does. Alright, Pylon. Let's go see what we're up against. Understood. Moving fast. Ah, really? Cicada? Or is it a porcupine? No, it's X5 CDX5. What the heck is that? Pirate. And no armor. I want this SRM triple plus. I have no idea what it is, but I want it. So let's just uh, shoot on this guy. Yeah, not really a good chance to hit. Let's leave the small laser off, save a little bit of heat. Oh my god, you hit with three. And of course you crit the thing that I wanted. <laughs> <laughs> Are you serious? Dude. Look at the evasion on this guy. Is that nine? Or is it eight? One, two, three, four, eight. Did you just sprint? You just sprinted, buddy. You have no idea what you're up against, do you? What do you need? Like, you really don't have any idea. Copy that. If you're trying to delay to your buddy show up, it's not really the right move, guy. Oh yeah. <laughs> you panic level critical, I guess so. Um I wanna see if we can get this guy to bail out. So let's do an offensive push on him. And I'm, I'm only going to use the uh, those guys. I don't want to kill this guy if I can avoid it. Two in the torso, 48 in the leg. Let's go after the leg and fire. No. Darn. We're going to have to pepper him with damage to get him to bail out, I guess. Let's get on this side of him. I don't know what we need to kill. Like... We could easily kill this guy if we're not careful. Um, don't want to try. I don't want to crit him. Um, that's least. That's less damage though. So let's just fire these guys and see what happens. I got him. Just gonna bail out. Ah, crap. Target 
Hit eliminate. That was a lot of damage. I guess we hit his torso. Holding for tactical advantage. All right, what are they doing? Ready for orders. Thank you, Captain Obvious. They're reserving, I guess, because the main guy's dead. Okay, we're going to just turn our camera slightly here. Uh, let's get recoil up. Uh, actually, I'm going to bring you down here. Keep you a little bit safe. I don't know what I'm up against yet, so... I'm worried about weight classes here. So let's get you back here. Alright, full speed. And we'll get cold metal into the same position until we know what's coming down here. Let's move back here. Offering up pylon is our uh, sacrificial lamb. Are you running? You're running. He's fleeing the interview. We got two mediums. What else do we have back there? So let's move. Yeah. Let's reserve. I want to see if they're going to come forward here. They may have more guys back there too, right? That's the other thing. Yeah, we're going to reserve right back to turn one. Alright, let's get Pylon going. Uh, let's get him down here. You got two more bloops, I think. Yep. So they got four mechs. What are they? Uh, they're drawing us in, I think. At least they're going to try to. All right, let's get you up um, over here for now. Going to use the height advantage, I think, on this side. And let's get Hickory up into the trees in here. We're going to have the range on him, but Cold Metal won't. He's going to need to get down to the valley. Blackjack, okay. We do have blackjack parts. That's one of the mechs we do have parts for. Don't particularly like blackjacks, but it is an option anyway. We gotta up, like I said, we gotta upton our mechs. So uh, let's fire the light rifle, I guess. Oh, is that a headshot? Oh, that looked like a headshot to me. Torso, eh? They got weak armor. Okay, could be another, uh, could be another blackjack. We'll find out here in a second. So we got three mediums and a light. All right, so let's reserve and see what they do. We got good evasion. I'm not really that worried. Are they going to reserve, are they? All right, let's play the reserve game. All right, fine, 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 fine. Let's see what we're up against, buddy. Move up here. So that's a cicada, and this is a cicada, both four L's, I have no idea what this guy is. Oh, that's the light mech, I guess. So let's fire in the blackjack, um, yeah. Okay, he's going to start to heat up now. Some heavy damage. Let's take out the blackjack, I think. The light rifles are only doing 30 damage, so, oh, is this a melee attack? My god, it's a melee attack. Wow, you even hit with all that evasion. Nice job. What do you need? Uh, you definitely need to move. That's what you definitely need to do. Still move over here in the trees. A little harder to hit, also a little bit of defense. Let's pace this guy. Wow. Scored a critical hit. Okay, he's got to move next. Yeah. And he's moving into his death. And he's shooting the wrong guy. Oh! Head hit. Thank goodness we put that helmet or the uh, cockpit on that guy. Alright, moving in. Don't have to sprint it. I'm just going to move up a little bit. Fire on this guy. This should kill him, I think. 
Yeah. Kill confirmed. I feel pretty confident about moving recoil in now. Wow, these guys both hit. Light damage, Commander. Order. I mean, it was a bad idea to move where he did, but they both hit. I wonder if that guy back there is stuck. Like this guy. I don't think he is stuck. I think he's just hiding. Alright, shooting on this guy with everything. Fire it all. Oh, yeah. Yeah, he's going down next turn. That guy's just sitting there, man. Yes, command. Uh, let's just move. Gonna move over here. Let's finish up that cicada. Fire everything into his back again, please. Nice. There we go. Bang, you're dead. Yep. Yeah, so do I. Let's just move back here. Fire everything. Roger. Well, this is just as easy as the last one. At least it'll give us some time to move to a new planet. We're going to pull back further into Steiner Space, I think. That's payback for his buddy. Showing minor damage. Um, let's just move up on this guy. Okay. Standing by. Let's try and finish this guy up. If we can. If we can burrow through his side, that'll be nice. Uh, let's go with everything. Roger. Ah, uh, not so good. That guy's just standing there. He must be stuck on something. That's actually a pretty good chance that they hit from that close. Fire everything on this guy. Both torsos are gone. He's a stick now. Goodbye. Alright, let's see if we can get up here. Yeah, let's see what a baby can do, eh? Commander. Double time. Let's go. Let's go finish this guy up fast. Commando. Javelin could be, maybe? Maybe, possibly, Javelin? Find out here in a second. Gonna lob some missiles on him. No, Commander 1C. Firing. Wow, that's gotta suck. Two fusion core crits already. Should have pushed him back a turn, but yeah. didn't really need to. Let's see if we can kill him with long range, just for the sake of it. Look at that. <laughs> All right, so. Yeah, I don't control what comes up in the battles, unfortunately. That clan mission a couple episodes ago where it was half a skull with a couple of assault vehicles, a heavy mech, like, you know, and then this one is, these last two for these, these uh, trap sprung missions have just been really nothing. All right, we're going to just let the chips fall where they may with those. How much are these things worth? 329,000. Injury resist cockpit. Um, that's a good possibility. AP ammo for the machine guns. Well, we got two selections. We didn't get the we didn't get the SRM we wanted. Oh well. So let's take the injury cockpit and let's take the pirate medium laser for cash. And let's let these kind of go with what we get here. So cicada part commando. Couple, well, three, four, five commando parts. Nice. Um, and we got the SRM. Okay, not too bad. Alright, so 9,000 repairs in four days. Not bad at all. Alright, so we can't really hang around here, unfortunately. Um, 
simply because we don't really have any missions we can do here. So we're going to move planets. Let's have a look at um, the navigation map. So we're at Garrison. Let's, we've got, I mean, we can move back again. There's a travel contract here, right? Eh? But I don't think we have the juice to do, do those ones because there was, uh, oh, Hillerod. 11 days. That's perfect. Manufacturing, travel hub, rich. Might get some good gear to buy here, maybe? Dominant fungus, eh? No hallucinatory vegetation, unfortunately, but, uh, oh, black market. Okay, let's go there. 25 grand, 11 days. Perfect. By your command. So we're still looking for that extra Zeus part, extra catapult part. Really what we want. Uh, let's pause here for a second. So we've got about 100,000 we can mess around with. So let's go to the mech bay, because we are traveling. We might as well get some more of the Wolverine repaired. We got about, like I said, about 100,000 to mess around with. So let's look at this. Let's replace the head. So it's 14. Replace the leg, 71. Uh, how much is a torso? Too much. Um, let's go back. So let's just replace the leg and the head for now. And we'll confirm that. Just to get this a little bit closer to being done. Right. I'll get it in the schedule. And we've got enough to make our financial report perfect. I wrapped up that job you asked for, Commander. Thank you. So when we arrive, we're gonna have a look a quick look in the store, see if there's anything we can use. Um, I'm really hoping the contracts are all local contracts. Um Uh, passing power, valuable support. Let's give him VIP quarters. I think he needs time to himself. Although it'd be nice to have a party. I think that just might, uh, <laughs> they think that just might activate his PTSD. So let's give him private quarters in the, uh, in the Argo. Make him a little happy. He's lost the unstable, gained high spirits. Perfect. But if, if any of our pilots need it, it's definitely Pylon. All right. Ready to go over financials whenever you are. Really, he, if you think about it, if you go back and go through all the videos, I think really without him piloting that uh, blackjack and taking all that, all those shots, I think we would have been in a lot worse situation than we are now. So, um, yeah, I'm kind of glad we have we've got a, a nice mech and a good pilot to be able to handle that stuff. All right, let's have a look at Hillerod here. Okay, maybe we can find something good. I want to find a nice SRM-6. Look at all the mech parts. Wow. Okay, EC2. No SRM-6s. Oh, there's some down here, but just normal ones. All right, we got five grand left. Wow. There's nothing really here that we need or want. It's mostly going to be picking up stuff off the ground. They got a full quick draw. Look at all the parts, though. I mean, yeah, well. Uh, okay, so, yeah. We'll end the episode here. Next time when we come back, we got a full month to get uh, financial report uh, money back. And we also got enough. I think, we, depending on what the contracts are like here, we're going to try and pull off some lower-level contracts. We might mix and, max la mix and match lances and run with the mechs that we have going right now in our light lance with some of the ones in our medium lance. Try and pull off a couple of missions. Um and get some cash going just so we can get the financial report out of the way with and the wolverine to a position where we can actually start repairing it um or adding gear to it that is so if you like the video please drop a like if you haven't subscribed please feel free to subscribe and check out my channel for other series that i've got going on right now battletech and rotech at the same time and until next time we'll see you all later